Congratulations on your new Wolf Vacuum Seal drawer. This quick start was designed to help you learn the tools and techniques you need to gain the most benefit from your Wolf Vacuum Seal drawer. As you will soon discover, the uses for this tool are practically endless. Preserve, protect, store, and ultimately cook with healthier, more flavorful results. Let's start by talking about the basics of vacuum sealing. Vacuum sealing is a method of packaging that removes air from a package prior to sealing, a method restaurateurs and grocers have used for decades. In fact, many of the meats, cheeses, and some frozen produce you find in your local grocery are packed this way. The oxygen that would normally interact with your food, hastening spoilage and deterioration, is reduced, keeping food fresher longer. In a chamber vacuum, such as your Wolf Vacuum Seal drawer, air is removed from both inside and around the bag. Once the desired amount of air is removed, the bag is sealed, and air rushes back into the chamber. The dissimilar pressure environments in and around the bag result in the bag collapsing around your food. Adjustable vacuum settings make this the ideal packing method for all sorts of dry, wet, and delicate items, from meats and vegetables to soups and sauces, from infused oils and vinegars to potato chips and fine spices. Included with your vacuum seal drawer are vacuum seal bags in assorted sizes, auxiliary vacuum hose and stopper, useful in resealing wine bottles, oils, and vinegars. Additionally, you may want to collect a permanent marker for labeling bags, jars, or bottles, small and short canning jars that will fit inside the closed chamber, paper towels, or a cloth for minor cleanup. Here are the basic steps. Step one, cuff the edge of the bag about two inches. This prevents contamination of the edge and ensures a tight, secure seal. Place food inside the bag. Step two, push the vacuum seal drawer to open. Turn on the vacuum seal drawer by pressing the power button. Unfold the top of the bag. Place the edge under the clip in the chamber. For smaller bags or heavier solid contents, insert the shelf to support the bag while sealing. Close the lid. Step three, select the desired vacuum and seal levels from zero to three based on the contents and your preferred preparation. Press start while lightly pressing the lid until the vacuum takes hold then let it run through its cycle. At the end of the cycle, the bag will be sealed. Conversely, press seal to quickly seal the bag and halt the vacuum process at any time during the cycle if, for example, the contents begin to overflow or you have removed enough air. If you would like to prematurely stop the cycle before it's finished, simply press seal, thus releasing any vacuum in progress and preventing the bag from sealing. To introduce you to the four vacuum and seal levels, let's walk through some specific examples. Fresh berries. Enjoy the goodness of a fruitful season all year long. For this use, select vacuum level zero. At this vacuum level, just enough air is removed to close the chamber and create that airtight seal without crushing the contents. We recommend selecting seal level two. To prevent the contents from being crushed, the bag should be no more than two thirds full. Speed marinating. Quickly infuse flavor and tenderness into meats and other proteins in minutes, instead of waiting hours or overnight. For this use, we recommend using vacuum level three. This removes air from the bag and forces the marinade into the meat. Since the food will not be negatively affected by the high pressure, a higher vacuum level can be used. By repeating this process, you can ensure juicy, brilliantly marinated steaks, chicken, tofu, or seafood. Unfinished wine. Preserve the freshness of open bottles of wine and other rigid containers. For this use, place the unit adapter and wine bottle adapter onto opposite ends of the vacuum hose and attach the unit adapter over the vacuum inlet inside the chamber. Place the bottle stopper in the bottle opening. Press AUXVAC until you reach your desired vacuuming level. For wine bottles, we recommend using vacuum level one. Please note, when AUXVAC is pressed, the vacuum and seal indicator lights will turn off. Select the vacuum setting to resume normal operation. For more ideas and techniques, please reference Mastering the Vacuum Seal Drawer, Techniques, Recipes, and More, a cookbook available online. Every recipe provides bag size, vacuum level, and seal level recommendations.
Finally, here are some helpful tips to remember as you begin using your vacuum seal drawer. Avoid sealing anything too hot. Allow contents to cool before packaging. To prevent overflows, avoid overfilling bags, especially with too much liquid. The bag should be no more than two-thirds full. There is no need to seal the bag if you plan to vacuum more than once, as is the case with speed marinating, infusing, or pickling. Keep the bag's top edge dry and free of food particles by cuffing the top edge. Be sure to unfold the bag before placing it in the vacuum seal drawer. Ensure a tight seal by removing bag ripples on the sealing bar. Your Wolf vacuum seal drawer should prove to be problem free. But remember, if you ever need assistance, the Wolf customer care team located in Madison, Wisconsin is standing by.